Boom! Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Let's Replay The Simpsons Game. In the last episode, what did we do? Oh, that's right, we helped out the sea captain over in that general direction. You can see all the uh, creepy rides and stuff, fighting off a heck of a lot of evil dolphins. And in today's episode, more evil things. This time, evil lard lad brought to life as we attempt the level Shadow of the Colossal Donut. Good evening, Springfield. Kent Brockman chasing local imbecile Homer Simpson and his delinquent son, Bart, who have picked a fight with an out-of-control donut mascot statue. Bart Simpson, are you and your father insane? Hi, lady, I'm on TV. I just said your name on TV. Don't tell Carl unless he sees this, in which case, hi, Carl, don't tell any I said your name. <laughs> Anyways, gotta go. You'll have to stop him, Bart. I'm too oh boy. Okay, so yeah, here we are. Fighting against Lard Lad. Those pesky aliens have brought him to life, and he's now bringing to life other adverts like these little evil crustios. Oh my god, there's a lot of explosions happening right now. Um, so yeah, this is a bit of a, a different level in that it's kind of set in one location. This little area of Springfield we walk around and it's basically one big boss battle against Lard Lad, hence why he's got a health bar at the top of the screen. But before we do that, and um, before we get on with actually killing him, we need to try and get the 9 collectibles for Homer and 10 collectibles for Bart. Let's get all them out of the way first, I don't have to worry about them, and then we can focus just on killing Lard Lad. How does that sound? So, <laughs> hopefully um, I can remember where they all are. I think I do. Let's go through it, shall we? Um, and as we do, don't relax yet. He's determined to find the father and son, and I assume to skin them alive. Oh God! Thanks, Kent, for that. Really appreciate that. So there's one up here. Uh, and as I do, I do want to quickly mention about. Well, not quickly, but just mention about um, where this this level sort of stems from. Oh, that's a Homer one. Okay. So, obviously. Lard Lad being brought to life is based on one of the um, Treehouse of Horrors. I think it's Treehouse of Horror six, but I just can't live which, that. honestly, I feel, too much. I feel like it's got to be one of the best uh, Treehouse of Horrors ever. It's got a great, great, great collection of stories. Um, this one, or the the one that this is based on, is the first part, which I think was called Attack of the Fifty Foot Eyesores. Um, and that's where, yeah, Lard Lad's brought to life, all these other adverts are brought to life, and Bart and Lisa have to sort of save the day, and they end up singing that song, Just Don't Look, Just Don't Look, and that's how you defeat the aliens. Uh, not the aliens, sorry, the uh, the adverts, by not looking at them. Um, but yeah, the, um... Oh, come on. Go on to that. Go on to that. There we go. But the other parts of the episode are just as good. Well, actually, better, I would say. You've got ones like, um... Give me that. You've got ones like Nightmare on Evergreen Terrace, the... Uh... Freddy Krueger ripoff with, um... Uh... Willy. Man, that is a great episode. A uh, great section. And then, possibly even better than that, is the last section of that, that episode, which is Homer Cubed. And that is the one where he turns 3D, which is what a lot of people um, know that episode 4 is just the 3D section. And he eventually... Oh, come on! Eventually ends up in the real world and goes to a, a naughty cake shop. Give me this ball cap! No! <laughs> right, so this one here I've got to try and oh, get with helium. It took up really quick and then... There we go. Grab it like that. So yeah. Some of those classic trios of horrors, they used to be so good. Honestly. Um, right, where am I up to? Let me concentrate on these first, because I think I might be missing some. There's definitely some on the green building. And we'll take a look at some of these locations in a bit, but... 
Let's just focus on these first. We head up on top of this, well, I assume it's a factory. Some sort of factory. At the back, there's another bark collectible. And then we glide down to this next building over. There's one over there. See, I've got this. I know what I'm doing. I practice. Believe it or not, I do practice. Oh, it's the grease recycling plant. Oh, there you go. Talking of Willy as uh, Freddy Krueger. This is where he, um, well, this is where he caught us. In what episode was that? Lard of the Dance, I think it was called. Another bark collectible down here. There's one for Homer I next to it. Two story. I like illegal things. I Man, there's so much, so much talking. Can I make this jump? I don't think I can actually. I needed to go the other. Well, actually. Oh, can I do it? I can do it. I thought I had to go the other way around, but hey ho, look at that. Another bar, uh, another Homer Duff cap. Oh, and then we died. Oh, and it puts us back there. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Can I even make that? Oh, I can. oh, 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 oh! All that practice for the collectibles, and I forgot about basic platforming. Ah. Okay, there we go. But uh, whilst we're talking about Trials of Horrors, which is what this level's based on, I guess it's only fair to ask what your guys' favourite Trials of Horrors... Trials of, Trials of Horror episode is, I should say. Or multiple episodes, if there's more than one. Um, I think that's probably got to be one of mine. I really do love the um, Dracula one as well, Mr. Burns' Dracula. That's great. There are, there are so many, honestly. Those early ones are so good. Uh, the bus, school bus where Bart sees the gremlin on the side, the rip-off of Twilight Zone. Another great episode. Alright, so there's another Bart collectible. No, Homer collectible even. I keep getting them mixed up on top of this building. And I think there's another one for Bart if I grab him. Up here. And... Is it up here? I don't know anymore. Let's just grab. I know there's one here for a, a definite. Let's just shimmy along this bar to the front of. What is this building? They've all got names, these buildings. This one is the. Ow, getting shot at. The Ritz Hotel for Transients. Oh, you are kidding me. I fell off there. Oh, I got lard ladded. Get away from me, lard lad. Alright, this is not a great position to be in. I've got to be honest. He is literally right there. Please move. Please clap. Please move. Good. Right, let's try and not fall off this time. Okay, so I was concentrating there, I don't want to fall off. Alright, then grab that. Good, that's 6 out of 10. I think we're looking good. Looking good here. There's definitely one more around here for Bart. Just gotta work out where it is. I actually think it's down here, but now I can't get it. Unless I jump. Hey, look at that, got it. Alright, 7 out of 10 for Bart. Homer on the other hand, oh god. <laughs> Next to the Spirograph factory, he's not doing too well. Hey, we got some Krusty Burgers, I didn't know it would do that. I guess that's if we need to recharge our food meter. Can I read what's on the menu? Wait a minute, that didn't look like English to me. Oh my god, it's Russian. No, not really. I don't want that. It's, it's gobbledygook. Um, Alright, so Homer's next one. Is. Oh, right, yeah. Somewhere up here, I think. Oh, or can I jump up here? Wait a minute. Oh, we'll go this way. So I think there should be a bottle cap at the top. Oh no, maybe I need to... Um... Oh, there you go, perfect. One on there. And where's the last one for Homer? 
Oh god, I remember. Oh wait, no, I've got the last one. I've still got three more to get. How have I missed so many? What is going on here? I knew this would happen. Don't use me for a guide for collectibles, people. <laughs> I'm not very organised. There's one over here. That brings us up to seven. There we go. Oh, there's one here for Bart, but Bart's down. Let's just take some cover away from Nardad firing us. And work out... I'm missing one. No, where's Bart? Let's just get Bart, shall we? Yeah, I'm not a big fan of this mission, I'm going to be honest with you. Um, it's too messy, there's too many things chasing me, it's annoying, and I... Yeah, it's not very interesting because it's just set in one location. Um, and I'm just not a big fan of boss fights, I'll be honest with you. I'm just not. Uh, so another one for Bart is if we... Ooh, get away from that, Dad. And we crush this fire hydrant. I'll smash it, which gives us an air current. And we need to head into the correctional facility. Which, thankfully, is not full of prisoners and evil, evil people. Oh, I tell a lie, actually. I think there are aliens who spawn here. They've done the time. No, they've done the crime, now do the time. And the collectible is right round the corner, tucked away. Here we go. Here we go. Grab that. So that's now 9 of 10 for Bart. The last one for Bart is... Um... Oh, on top of the uh, the red the red structure. Yep. Alright, good. Yeah, if we go on that updraft there... We'll just use this. That will also work. And then... Oh, come on. Catch that. Catch it. Catch it. There we go. Wait, where am I meant to go up here? Oh, and then just... Ha-ha! Up here! Right, I can I can sort of relax a little bit. Oh, we've got all of Bart's. We have won the Krusty Meal Trophy. Mm, okay. I don't know if I want one of those little toys now, since they're murdering me. Maybe I just need to set it to the uh, not evil position on the back. That might be the problem. Uh, is there another Homer collectible here or have I just missed it? I might have just missed it. Hmm. Let's try and grab this one. There's one inside that tube you can see there. This one is a real pain to get though. You need to be just right with the timing. Oh! Nope. And, oh no, I've messed up big time. Because Lard Lad really shouldn't be around me when I try this. Otherwise it's very, very difficult to get anything done. So in the meantime, let me just have a quick run around, make sure I haven't missed any. Okay, I found out where the the bottle cap is for Homer I was looking for. I was getting mixed up with crane arms, I was thinking it was that one. And it was this one. It's on top of there. There we go. And we've also managed to get Lard Lad away from us, so hopefully we have enough time to focus on ooh, getting in this. Yes! Ha 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 ha! Did it. And we got deep fried duff. Mm. Uh, and one more even from any character to increase the family's power meter. I would quite like to try that deep fried duff. Sounds like something you get in Scotland. They deep fry everything. Alright, so now that's all the collectibles done. I can. I can breathe, because now we can actually get on with the level and get this over and done with. Which is by, if you actually read the things to-do list, open Lard Lad's first hatch and disable his wiring. Yep, that's why um, there's a big target on his back, and that's why there's so many areas to get up and get height. Because eventually, we'll need to uh, sort of float on down above him. I'll show what I mean in just a minute. So we need to get... Oh, get away from me, lad, lad, no! 
Okay, fine. Distract him like that. Oh, no, I do need I do need Bart at that side because he's the one who shoots. Mark Simpson isn't looking very good. He may have cowabunged for the last time. Oh my God, Bart's last cowabunge. No, this is this is not good. I need to get behind him. Get away from me, mini crusties! So what, let's get up. Let's get up here. This is good. This is better. All right. Oh crap! I think he's seen us. Yep. This is not good. I lied. All right. Come on. Keep on walking. Keep on walking, lad, lad. Man, I did this so much better on my old Let's Play. I know that for a fact. All right. So we hit him in the back. His hatch opens. And we destroy his wiring. Worst video game cliche ever. There we go. It's got an obvious weakness. Nice cliche to get there. A must have for Masters of the Obvious. Yep, and that takes down his health by a third. So you've guessed it. We need to do it two more times. It goes for a little run. Just a little jog. Um, in fact, we could probably try and get him when he goes. It's all about sort of guessing where he's going to end up. And then predicting his, his pattern. Oh, uh, so he's walking that way now. Hmm. Okay. So maybe if we stay up here, we'll get him when he comes round the road. Get away from me. I'm busy. Yeah, we, we do it like this. We do it like this. Let's just hopefully hope he doesn't see us. Oh, we just saw us in a little bit. Uh oh. Mini Krusties are after me. They are very good at finding me. Alright, here he comes. The annoying thing is, is that if you get this wrong, you have to kind of wait a long time sometimes. Right, we got it, we got it. Hover down. Why? Alright, good, that was good. That was quite quick. And now he's going to run... Oh, perfect. Near all those buildings. That will give us a lot of height advantage. That's what I like to see. We'll bounce up here, bounce up there. Where has he gone? Where has he gone? Oh, God, he's over there. Okay. That's it. Turn around. Turn around, big boy. Oh, it's seen me again. Oh no! He's got very good vision for a, a big inanimate, turned animate object. Alright, okay, go that way then, whatever. I just need to see your back. Oh no. Oh no. I timed that wrong. Go. There we go. And then jump. Try to show a little dignity in victory. Eat fist, Lord Crunch! Shad Spot, how could Lord Lad lose to that guy? Don't yell at Lord Lad when you really want to yell at me. I screwed this whole thing up. You're right, I do blame you. <laughs> Four minutes. Four minutes. Yeah, right. I guess they don't include the collectibles on that, but oh, what a what a nasty level. I'm so I'm glad to see the back of that. Let's just uh, let's put it that way. Anyway, so we got all the collectibles, got both trophies, and we got the cliche. We're all set. Oh, okay. I thought there'd be a I thought it'd be a cutscene there, but I guess that's on the on the next level. Okay, we're good. So yeah, uh, next up, I think it's going to start getting a bit interesting because we're going to get uh, some themed levels soon enough. But um, yeah, well, we'll figure out all that stuff. Oh no! In the next episode. Until then, thank you very much for watching and goodbye.